Is an all-meat diet a one-way ticket to excruciating kidney stones? This question has been on the minds of many who are considering or already following a carnivore diet. It's a question that sparked heated debates and left many wondering about the potential risks of ditching carbs and embracing animal products. The allure of weight loss and muscle gain often overshadows the potential downsides. The truth, as with most things in health, is a bit more nuanced. It's not just about what you eat but how your body processes it. While the carnivore diet has gained popularity for its potential benefits, concerns about its impact on kidney health, particularly the risk of kidney stones, are entirely valid. High protein intake can lead to increased calcium and oxalate levels in the urine, which are key contributors to stone formation. In this comprehensive exploration, we'll delve into the carnivore diet, examining its principles and promises. We'll dissect the science behind kidney stone formation, looking at the roles of hydration, dietary choices, and genetic predispositions, and we'll examine whether there's a real connection between the two. Are those on a meat-heavy diet more prone to kidney stones, or is it a myth? We'll separate fact from fiction, debunk common myths, and provide evidence-based insights. Our goal is to equip you with the knowledge to make informed decisions about your diet and kidney health. Understanding the balance between benefits and risks is crucial. So buckle up as we embark on this journey to uncover the truth about the carnivore diet and its potential impact on your kidneys. Your health journey starts here. The carnivore diet, as the name suggests, involves consuming primarily animal products like meat, poultry, fish, and eggs, while excluding plant-based foods. Proponents tout its potential benefits including weight loss, improved blood sugar control, and reduced inflammation. They argue that by eliminating processed foods, sugars, and inflammatory plant compounds, the body can enter a state of healing and optimal function. The emphasis on animal protein and fat provides satiety, potentially reducing overall calorie intake. Additionally, the absence of carbohydrates can lead to lower blood sugar levels, which can be particularly beneficial for individuals with insulin resistance or type 2 diabetes. However, it's crucial to acknowledge that this way of eating is restrictive and may lack essential nutrients found abundantly in fruits, vegetables, and whole grains. Kidney stones, those hard deposits that can form in the kidneys, are notorious for causing intense pain. These pesky formations occur when certain substances in the urine such as calcium, oxalate, and uric acid become highly concentrated. This concentration allows these substances to crystallize and clump together, forming stones that can range in size from a grain of sand to a golf ball. Several factors contribute to kidney stone formation, with diet playing a significant role. Dehydration is a major culprit, as it reduces urine volume and increases the concentration of stone-forming substances. High intake of oxalate-rich foods like spinach, rhubarb, and chocolate can also increase the risk, as can excessive consumption of animal protein and sodium. So, can a diet primarily composed of meat increase the risk of kidney stones? This is a question that has sparked much debate among health professionals and diet enthusiasts alike. The answer is not a simple yes or no. It involves understanding the intricate balance of our body's metabolic processes and how different foods can influence them. While meat itself doesn't directly cause stones, its impact on certain metabolic processes warrants attention. The way our body processes animal protein can have significant effects on our overall health. Animal protein, particularly red meat, contains purines, which are broken down into uric acid in the body. This process is a natural part of digestion but can have consequences if not managed properly. Elevated uric acid levels can contribute to the formation of uric acid stones, a type of kidney stone. These stones can be incredibly painful and may require medical intervention to treat. However, it's important to note that this risk is more pronounced in individuals with a predisposition to gout or a history of uric acid stones. Genetics and personal medical history play a crucial role in determining one's risk. While a high protein intake can potentially increase uric acid excretion, it's not a guarantee that everyone following a carnivore diet will develop kidney stones, explains Dr. X, a nephrologist at Y Hospital. It's essential to consider individual health factors and consult with a healthcare professional before making significant dietary changes. If you're considering or already following a carnivore diet, there are several steps you can take to minimize your risk of kidney stones. First and foremost, prioritize hydration. 
drinking plenty of water throughout the day helps dilute urine and prevent the concentration of stone-forming substances. Aim for at least 8 to 10 glasses of water daily. Secondly, be mindful of your sodium intake. High sodium consumption can increase calcium excretion in the urine, raising the risk of calcium-based stones. Limit processed meats, canned goods, and added salt. Additionally, incorporating low oxalate vegetables like cucumber, lettuce, and cauliflower can help balance your intake. Despite its growing popularity, the carnivore diet is often met with skepticism and concerns about its long-term health effects. One prevalent myth is that it inevitably leads to kidney damage and stones. However, this claim lacks scientific backing. While excessive protein intake can strain the kidneys in individuals with pre-existing kidney conditions, there's no evidence to suggest that a well-formulated carnivore diet harms healthy kidneys. The kidneys are remarkably adaptable organs capable of handling a wide range of dietary approaches, assures Dr. Z, a registered dietitian specializing in metabolic health. As long as individuals maintain adequate hydration and consume a balanced intake of nutrients, the carnivore diet is unlikely to pose significant risks to kidney health. Proper hydration is paramount for everyone, but it takes on even greater significance when following a carnivore diet. The absence of fruits and vegetables, which naturally contribute to fluid intake, makes conscious hydration efforts non-negotiable. Aim for a minimum of 2 to 3 liters of water per day, and consider incorporating other hydrating beverages like herbal teas and bone broth. Hydration not only supports kidney function, but also aids in digestion, nutrient absorption, and overall cellular health. Remember, thirst is often a late indicator of dehydration, so make it a habit to sip on water throughout the day, especially during and after meals. Section 8. Electrolytes and Minerals. Balancing Your Intake. The carnivore diet, while rich in protein and fat, can be low in certain electrolytes and minerals typically obtained from plant-based foods. Electrolytes like potassium, magnesium, and sodium play crucial roles in maintaining fluid balance, nerve function, and muscle contractions. To ensure adequate electrolyte intake, incorporate electrolyte-rich foods like bone broth, coconut water, and mineral-rich salts. Additionally, consider supplementing with electrolytes under the guidance of a healthcare professional, especially during periods of intense physical activity or if you experience symptoms of electrolyte imbalance. Section 9. Listen to your body, the key to dietary success. Embarking on any dietary change, especially one as restrictive as the carnivore diet, requires careful consideration and a personalized approach. While general guidelines provide a starting point, it's essential to listen to your body and adjust your intake based on your individual needs and responses. Pay attention to how you feel, monitor your energy levels, and consult with your healthcare provider regularly to assess your progress and address any concerns. Remember, there's no one-size-fits-all approach to nutrition, and what works for one person may not work for another. Section 10, Carnivore Diet and Kidney Stones, The Final Verdict. So, can the carnivore diet cause kidney stones? This question has sparked much debate and concern among health enthusiasts and medical professionals alike. The answer, as we've explored, is not a simple yes or no. It involves a deeper understanding of how our bodies process different types of food. While the diet itself doesn't directly cause stones, its impact on certain metabolic processes, particularly uric acid levels, warrants attention. High levels of uric acid can lead to the formation of kidney stones, especially in susceptible individuals. Individuals with a history of kidney stones, gout, or other kidney-related issues should exercise caution and consult with their healthcare provider before adopting this way of eating. It's essential to understand your own health risks. For those without pre-existing conditions, following a well-formulated carnivore diet while prioritizing hydration, electrolyte balance, and regular monitoring is unlikely to pose significant risks to kidney health. Staying hydrated and maintaining a balance of electrolytes can mitigate potential issues. However, it's crucial to remember that long-term studies on the carnivore diet are limited and more research is needed to fully understand its potential effects on kidney health and overall well-being. Until then, it's wise to proceed with caution and stay informed. Section 11. Empowering Your Health Journey Knowledge is power. Navigating the world of nutrition can feel overwhelming, especially with conflicting information and ever-evolving dietary trends. 
The key is to approach dietary decisions with a critical eye, seek evidence-based information, and prioritize your individual health needs. The carnivore diet, like any dietary approach, has its potential benefits and risks. By understanding the science behind kidney stone formation, the nuances of the carnivore diet, and the importance of personalized care, you can make informed choices that support your overall health and well-being. Remember, knowledge is power, and by empowering yourself with the right information, you can confidently navigate the complexities of nutrition and make choices that align with your health goals.